Good morning, everyone. Uh, I continue my uh, video uh, talking about the applicability domain toolbox. After you choose the uh, to the common setting as I mentioned in the, the first video, and after that you click the calculate AD, and after that they will run uh, they will run for you around 1,000 uh, iteration. Uh, so in here, after you finish run, uh, you can uh, go to the uh, application uh, applicability domain toolbox here, and you can uh, see the result. For example, here, uh, if you click the test result, that will show you a lot of information. Right? For example, in the previous, you put the potential uh, uh, potential domains uh, with. Uh, let me see here potential domain uh, with the Gaussian and uh, you uh, select the distance around uh, 90, uh, 95% and the K around 5 and threshold around 2.25 here all information here they they say in the option folder and next uh, you will show the uh, see the result e view concessions uh, in here uh, as you can see um, uh, as I mentioned before, right? We we select eight methods to uh, run the AD model, and for that, in here they said that the compound uh, number twenty eight was included by seven methods, and not the one the uh, the sample number three and number four was included, was included, was removed uh, by five methods, similar with the sample number 51 would include it by three methods and the sample number one from number one to 41 would include by two methods the uh, graph show the consensus of our layers and next uh, if you want to see the result uh, for William plot it be very important and you can public you can difficult to public your data right and here you need to load your uh, data. It is very important, and you have a lot of mistakes. And here you need to load the experiments, experiment um, in the trend sense. I load it. After that, you click um, experiment in the uh, uh, calculate test. You load it. And here load the experiment in the test sense, experiment in the test set. And the last one is load experiment in the calculate test. And after that. If you want to add the labels of sample to the plot, and you click in here, and you see the William plot, and here they show the William plot, right? And you can see, uh, uh, you remember the the compound number twenty eight was included by a methods. It is the uh, outlier. They they located far away from the threshold we set uh, in here. They the leverage around zero point three. And the uh, compound number three, uh, as I mentioned before, uh, would include it by around five methods. Here also outlier, and we only choose the compound belong this section. And in the in the this section and not the section here, we need to exclude. And after that, you choose here, and you can uh, did further analysis. For example, ADME or modular molecular docking, um, uh, whatever you want. Uh, so next, uh, you go to the toolbox again, and you can see the case results. In here, they show you the potential compounds uh, belong to the AD model, uh, belong to the threshold. And here, they show that around 25 compounds with the case uh, values uh, belong to the uh, AD model with optimization with case. And in here, you can select the compound to your uh, research, up to your purpose. So in this um, video, I show you how to uh, align the data. Uh, in here, I also show you the the, the papers. Uh, they conduct the QSAP model and public on the cell press. And they also show the, um, apply the ap application uh, capability domains to Detect uh, whether or not uh, which compounds it belong to the uh, the thresholds, and you can see here the same with our result, right? The number, the um, uh, the test, the, the the sample number one to fourteen a maybe uh, outside uh, 
be uh, outside the threshold and they, they excluded uh, excluded for further research and they also show the best compounds in here um, around one two three four five six seven eight compounds to uh, uh, not the one for example they evaluate drug like this up um, a, a properties or they can use for molecular docking uh, whatever they want uh, and I also uh, rec uh, recommend you if you go to the help, uh, help folder in the application domain toolbox you click the sample here and they can uh, explain you details uh, at, as I mentioned in the deep video for example how to load the data how to uh, select um, AD model setting and up, how, how to explain the results uh, some kind of data and the final one here they also uh, give you the the command uh, to uh, run the model if you don't like to um, show the toolbox you can run the command whatever you want uh, today I uh, finished uh, my video how to use the AD um, domain um, the applicability domain toolbox in the in the MATLAB I hope this video will help you for further research. Thank you for listening.